previously on Battlestar Galactica. What do you think? Mm, I'm not for me. Making a mess. Oh, no. I just dipped it in the thing. So we are tasting up the dandelion wine. It's going to be better than the gin, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. We didn't make the gin. No. Ooh. Yeah, it definitely needs some time to age and mellow, but I'm very happy with how it's that so... turned out. It's dry. It's nice. Mm -hmm. It kind of tastes like bubbles. It, it largely almost tastes like a Pinot Grigio. Mm -hmm. Like that same kind of mouthfeel. Hi. Hey you, welcome home to Miller's Landing. I'm Sue, and this is Sumi. We're here in Gardening Zone 6B, which means the dandelions are months behind us, which means the wine is progressing. Come on along, let's see what's happening. I believe today is bottling day. I, I, yeah, that's it. Strong man. Heavy liquid. What part of the process are we at? The finish line. Woohoo! Yo, that looks so much better than it did the other night. Yeah, it doesn't look cloudy at all, does it? No. Oh I my did. Uh, I did notice when I was looking at it that um, there is now a thin layer of yeast on the bottom. Just above There's the There's just line. a bit of a white layer. Okay. Uh, it was more defined before I carried it up the stairs. Yeah, it fuzzed out a little bit, fuzzed but little cool. Bit. But we're just gonna let this sit until it's actually time to go, and the rest should precipitate back out again. Alrighty. Sanitize. Getting the sanitizer ready to soak all the bits so we can have nice clean wine. All of the bits. Nice all clean wine. Nice clean wine. Having tube issues here. Liv's been fussing with it to try not to get air in the lines. Yeah. Well, the yeast in the lines. Yeast in the lines. And air in the lines. Yeah, you're right. All of the above. So you're shortening the line yeah. to the bucket. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, the one that's going into the bucket. Yeah. And I may have to prime this again. Uh, I lost it. Nope. Oh, there it is. Do you see that looks a lot better? It's not yeah. perfect, and I am committed to, or not committed, yeah, I guess we're committed to getting a little bit of sediment in the bottom of each of these, but I don't want to do that. Yeah, it shouldn't turn to gravy. <sighs> yeah, no, it shouldn't yeah, turn to gravy. last three we did is a little milky. It's fine. All the sediment will settle. Um, when it comes time to drink it, you'll just pour slowly. Alright. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, let me get you a bottle. I have. You got one? I see I will pass this off to you. Got you. Please and thank you. Okay. Do you need to sandy the corker? Oh no, that's the corker. This is the corker. The corker is in the sand. Okay, so that's the capper. Yeah, corker, capper. If we get there, I'll just sew this. Okay. <laughs> Ah, 
that's it, huh? Yeah. It's coming up muddy. I could let this settle and then try to get, you know, this One more jar out, out of, of here. Um, I don't think it's worth somebody it. Somebody who had done, a, a brewer with more experience who had, like, done this and put it into another container and then another container, you know, you get less and less of the shit at the bottom, but... For, like, I am not a big drinker. And that's a and lot of this wine. this is a lot of wine, so I'm not going to lose my mind about the last, you know... Half gallon. It, it says one gallon. I would only ever get maybe a half gallon out of this, and I think I'm good. We're going to make more next year, most likely, and yep. this is not going to be gone by then. So we have all these beautiful bottles, and now the last little bit is to put some sealing wax on them. This is so cool. Okay. Just... Okay. No. Oh, okay. Grab it. Yeah. Kitchen hands. How about that? All right. There you go. Just have to wiggle it around a little bit. Okay, so what happens next on my sits. people with my it sits. And then what? <laughs> well we start drinking some of it now. Well not now. Not I'm now. Just... <laughs> it's right now. I mean, I'm Crack a bottle gonna... open. I mean... It's still kind of fresh. Do you think it'll be ready by Thanksgiving? I'm gonna crack a bottle on Thanksgiving. I like that plan. Let's do that. A little bit of summertime in the you know, middle of fall. A little bit of springtime. Dandelions. <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging out with us on our forage to ferment. What? I like forage to ferment. Forage to ferment? Yeah. All right. We hoochin. Hoochin. Backyard Thanks. hoochin. Backyard hooching. We're not outside. We were outside. This came from our backyard. Well, a little bit of it. Most of it came from a field down the street. <laughs> They, we just don't grow them like they do. <laughs> See, the, them field-grown dandelions got a lot of chunk to them. Mwah. Catch you up soon. Bye-bye. Wave.